Hi, this is Dr. Victor bringing you the fourth highlight of this podcast that is effect of mavacamten on echocardiographic features in symptomatic patients with obstructive hypertrophic cardiomyopathy. As we know in Explorer HCM study, it was demonstrated that mavacamten, a cardiac myosin inhibitor, improved symptoms, exercise capacity, and left ventricular outflow tract obstruction in patients with obstructive hypertrophic cardiomyopathy. The purpose of this study was to evaluate Mavacantin's effect on measures of cardiac structure and function and its association with changes in other clinical features. The key echocardiographic parameters from serial echocardiograms over 30 weeks were analyzed from 251 symptomatic obstructive hypertrophic cardiomyopathy patients out of which 123 were on Mavacantin and 128 were on placebo. As a result, more patients on Mavacantin, that is 80.9% versus placebos, 34% showed complete resolution of mitral valve systolic anterior motion after 30 weeks with a p-value of 0.001. Mavacantin also improved measures of diastolic function versus placebo including left atrial volume index with a mean change from baseline of minus 7.5 ml per meter square with a p-value of significance of less than 0.001 and lateral E to E prime ratio mean change of minus 3.8 versus 0.04 in placebo with a p-value of significance of less than 0.001. Among Mavacamten treated patients, improvement in resting valsalva and post exercise LVOT gradients, left atrial volume index, and lateral E to E prime ratio was associated with reduction in NT pro BNP with a p value of significance of less than 0.03 for all. Reduction in left atrial volume index was associated with improved peak exercise oxygen consumption with the p-value of 0.04. As a conclusion, Mavacampton significantly improved measures of left ventricular diastolic function and systolic anterior motion, improvements in left ventricular outflow tract obstruction, left atrial volume index, and E to E prime ratio was associated with reduction in a biomarker of myocardial wall stress. These findings demonstrate improvements in important markers of the pathophysiology of obstructive hypertrophic cardiomyopathy with Mavacampton. Thank you. 